Hi guys, it's Morgan McMichaels, and each week I'll be picking the top lip sync performances from queens all over the world. Living for the lip sync. This episode, I'm super excited. I love this bitch very, very much. Give it up for Roxy Andrews giving you all about that bass. When I met Roxy, she was a bigger girl. She lost a whole bunch of weight and she is taking care of herself. She's eating healthy, she's going to the gym and she looks fucking amazing. When you watch the video and you see her come out of this curtain, it's body, baby. It's smooth, it's beautiful. And she lets you know, you don't have to be a skinny little twig to be gorgeous. And I think that's a really great message from the song and from Roxy. Check out Roxy Andrews in the link below, all about that piece. If you've been watching every episode of Living for the Lip Sync, you will know that we have been featuring queens from RuPaul's Drag Race season seven. Kasha is performing Tina Turner's Proud Mary. Now, I've seen a lot of queens do Tina Turner, especially Tammy Brown, because we all know that Tammy's favorite, favorite, favorite ever is Tina. But Kasha turns it. I really like how she did it. Now she doesn't move like a spring chicken because she's a seasoned queen and honey, bones do break. But I liked what she did. I think her costume was amazing. You saw the costume on the reveal. She had just having a good time. And like I always say, drag at the end of the day is about having a good time. So check out her video in the link below and let us know what you think in the comments below. Our fan submission this episode comes from Kevy in Chicago, Illinois. And she writes, I love everything about drag. The outfits, the lip syncing, the culture, it's all wonderful. I've always been a diva. Oh really bitch, always been a diva? And drag allows me to let my inner diva out unapologetically. I believe drag is a fascinating form of performance art with such a rich history that I love to learn about. And I hope someday to open a museum dedicated to drag performance. So I picked Kevy. she's not in drag, she's just kind of lip syncing, but the video is really, really entertaining. There's a lot going on. There's a background and a foreground and the bitch is lip syncing, but she's working those arms, hi, she's working those arms. She's doing Masterpiece by Jessie J, and you all know how I feel about Jessie J. Love her. So let her know and let me know what you think about her performance in the comments below. And remember, be nice because we're here to teach and we're here to learn. And the day you think you stop learning is the day you need to quit because nobody's too good to learn. Our drag tip this episode comes from Trinity K. Bonet. Hi you guys, it's me, Trinity K. Bonet from RuPaul's Drag Race season six. And I have advice for young queens. Okay, listen, if you decide to be an entertainer, always strive to be the entertainer that you choose to be. It's okay to have role models and look up to people, but try to have your own sense of individuality and come up with the character that you want and just fine tune and groom that character. People will accept and appreciate the person that you want them to be because it's original. Love you. Are you a fierce lip syncer? I would love to see you post your videos on the World of Wonder Facebook page. Remember, put your email and hopefully we see you on a future episode of Living for the Lip Sync. Don't forget to subscribe to WOW Presents and me, Morgan McMichaels. I love you. Goodbye. Do you have a YouTube channel and want to be part of the WOW Presents network? Email us at youtube at worldofwonder.net.